forecast. Can we make it to the weekend? Yeah, for three days or two weeks, somewhere in there. Right. right? Yeah, and actually my forecast is about as confident as that. It's somewhere in between three and 14 days of dry wow. weather. Wow. <laughs> uh, this, uh, this time last year, that uh, one uh, uh, interview uh, was correct there that uh, it was snowing on the 5th, the heavy snow that hit. And yesterday, a glorious day. This weather report brought to you by the Yale Town BIA. We're starting out generally clear around much of the south so far. What we're expecting actually is to see again the clouds sort of arcing up and over that high pressure ridge that's on the coastline and keeping our weather pattern nice and dry. Now there's some fog out over the Strait of Georgia. A little bit of fog showing up along sections of the river valley. It's very shallow thus far. It may be freezing on contact. Keep that in mind with our temperatures near the zero mark for this morning. I want to go region by region around the province here and show you what's happening with the weather. A little clear on the west coast. Look at that. 10 in the sun in Tofino. Mostly clear in Victoria. But the fog banks that are out over the Strait of Georgia right now just clogging up the east coast of Vancouver Island. I suspect it'll be cool and misty in Nanaimo most of the day. Now it's completely clear in Sea to Sky Country. The temperature inversion locked in place, so it's quite mild up on the slopes. Worcester Village, your high today is about three in the sunshine. And across the BC interior, well, the temperature inversion actually makes for such a, a stable pattern. There's lots of cloud filling all the valleys across the BC southern interior. Only a little sun over higher terrain. And those high temperatures, they're near zero, our high for today. But well, we're going to say about, you know, six, seven, eight degrees right across the region and generally sunny skies. For tomorrow, it's an encore, but over time, the dry pattern hangs on, the outflow breeze dies down, we'll see a little more fog uh, in the mornings, and it may persist into the afternoons. So for Friday, calling it a mix of sun and cloud. By Saturday, more or less clouding over, and then back to a bit of an outflow breeze in the longer range picture that carries us into next week. Yes, the chance of rain zero and it looks like we will see at least a little sun for every single day okay let's get a traffic update Thor how are you this morning not bad